Hey everyone, it's Eric. Hello, yes, what do you want? And today I have a Bath & Body Works haul for you. Most of this haul is going to be from the Clean Hands event that's going on. So I got into the stores today, I bought some soaps, I bought a whole bunch of pocket backs, but I also got into the store earlier in the week during that 40% off the entire store sale. I also have some three-wick candles here that are online exclusives, plus a few other three-wick candles that are just repurchases for me. So let's just get into all this stuff, you guys. So this morning, I got to the store about 10 minutes after 10. Our store opened at 10 a.m. this morning, and I thought that was a pretty good time to get there. I know I wanted to get there early for the pocket backs. Uh, earlier in the week, I scoped out a few stores to see who had the best like quantity of pocket backs, like variety. So I went to this store this morning um, up in Avon, Ohio, because they just were loaded with different pocket backs. So yes. Oh, well, in that case, it's fabulous. Yeah. Got up there and I was so surprised how many people were already in the store like 10 minutes in. There were actually a few people already checking out. I heard one customer say that she already bought 20 pocket backs and 20 soaps. So yeah, people were getting in and out. And while I was there, uh, by the time I left, which I think I was in the store maybe 15 minutes, uh, it was like semi-annual sale in there. It was packed. It was just packed. I was, I was like, oh my God, no! wow, I can't believe this many people are really wanting soaps and pocket backs. But yeah, there were, were a lot of people out there. So let's get into it. The soaps that I picked up. So the first soap that I got was this Lakeside Life. And I've been wanting to pick this one up. I love the packaging on this and the color. This color blue looks real pretty. This is Bergamot Wild Sage and a Touch of Evergreen. And I, I get the evergreen and the sage, but it almost smell like a little apple in it. It's does it smells a little apple to me Ooh, it's getting kind of foamy okay so that was lakeside life and then i also got another autumn s'mores i've had this one before this is your crisp apple gooey marshmallow and cinnamon spice this is a nice classic and then i picked up this basil leaf and apple this is crisp apple, fresh picked basil and morning dew i thought this might be good in the kitchen just sounded kind of like a kitcheny soap. It's a little on the perfumey side though, so this might become a guest bathroom soap. It's kind of perfumey. It's it has more of a perfume fragrance than I thought it would. And then the last one I picked up, because I only got four soaps, you guys, uh, was this red cherry and oud. This is dark red cherries, agave drizzle, and oud wood. And So this one's more, I smell the cherry, kind of earthy with that oud wood. It's not as cologne or even strong smelling to me as I thought it would be. It doesn't smell bad. So I picked up that as well. I did have a $10 off coupon that I had. Not the coupons that get mailed to us, but I did have a $10 off coupon. How much did I save? The soaps uh, came to $2.53, and then my pocket bags, the majority of pocket bags I got uh, were $0.77 cents with uh, $10 off. What a great deal. So not a bad deal. I bought a bunch of pocket bags, you guys, because I go through them pretty quickly, actually. So I keep them in this, um, I have this little white barn crate that I have with my pocket bags, and uh, this is pretty much all I have left so it was time to restock because I'll go through these pretty quickly so I just have some of the old summer ones and well, here's an old vampire blood from last year and uh, yeah gingerbread bakery so some Christmas ones fall ones in here yeah just a little bit of everything a little couple summer ones but anyways I put this out near where I keep my keys so when I'm heading out the door I can grab them and go so I figured this way I'll be ready to go with some more. Set this down real quick. All right, let me get my little bag here because I want to be able to dump these back in this bag as we go. So I did pick up five of these Lakeside Life in the pocket bag. I really like that fragrance. So I did get five of those. I'm just going to throw them in here. Five of the Lakeside Life. And then I picked up a bunch of these um, 
pink bubble gums. I had this one last year. I really liked it. So did get the pink bubble gum. Let's see, I have one. Let's see, there's three, four, five, six, uh, seven. So I did seven of the pink bubble gum. And since it's bubble gum, that big classic flavor lasts an extra, extra, extra long time. And then I did get two of these blackberry basils and as well as found two of the iced lemon pound cake so I picked up two of those that's such a nice scent I got one endless sea just to have it's kind of a nice clean fragrance so I thought that would be nice in a pocket bag and then I picked up two of these fruit squeeze it just kind of smells I don't know kind of lemony fruity to me and then Picked up two of these apple and cedar wood. I like the apple cedar wood. So I picked up two of those. I also picked up two of the blueberry and bourbon. And this one, um, this is the first time today I ever smelled this in the store. And <laughs> the bourbon really comes through on that. I thought it'd be more blueberry, but you get a lot of bourbon. <laughs> I smell liquor. So do I. And then I picked up four more of these sweet apple. I hauled some of these earlier already and I've already gone through those. So I've got four more sweet apple. Sweet apple to me smells just like apple weather, the candle. That's what this smells like to me is apple weather. So I wanted four more of these for the fall. And then I picked up a whole bunch of these marshmallow treats because they smell like a toasted marshmallow to me. So let's see, I got one. Let's see, there's three. Five. I have seven of the marshmallow treats and I found some with like blue caps So there was white capped ones and blue capped ones. So I got seven of those and then the one I wanted the most was the uh, pear vanilla. I Love this one. I love the pear in this. So I got a whole bunch of these. So let's see one three five Seven I got nine of the uh, pear vanilla that one's just really really nice so that was the pocket backs, you guys. Um, the second store I was at, though, while I was looking for pocket backs, I noticed some single wick candles. So I was getting ready to check out. I saw these single wick candles. So I saw the Cranberry Orange Seltzer. I love that candle. I can't wait for that to come back out in a three wick. And then I saw Bourbon Maple, which I was smelling that and just made me ready for fall, ready for fall candles, you guys. The salted butterscotch and the sweet whiskey. So saw those while I was getting ready to check out. Earlier in the week, we had the 40% off event and I had a app reward that was going to expire that day. So I got into the store, I'm like, I have to use this reward. I mean, you're just throwing away money at that point if you don't use it. So I got into the store and there really wasn't anything that I really wanted to buy I guess that just didn't work out really but I did pick up um, the little uh, mushroom pocket back so these guys run at $6.95 and I got that for 40% off they're so cute these little mushroom guys adorable cute as a button and I think that came to like my cheapest my cheapest haul ever um, it came to $4.44, that's with the tax. It was $4.17 and then with tax it was $4.44. But I had a reward that was gonna expire, so I ended up getting a single wick of the Pumpkin Bonfire, which I absolutely love Pumpkin Bonfire. It's probably one of my all-time favorite fall candles. Mm, I just love that scent, you guys. So, so excited for the three wick because I need to load up because I'm pretty much out of Pumpkin Bonfire. <laughs> Heaven forbid. Now, candles, you guys. Three Wick Candles. I did order some of those um, online exclusive candles. And I I believe they were probably the $10 off. I'm sure that's what these were. They weren't. There wasn't some great deal going on. But I did get some uh, of the online exclusive. So I did get the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. I'm not really a big fan of Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. But I just wanted it for the collection. This is your warm cinnamon, fresh ground clove, vanilla cream, and brown sugar. You get the cinnamon and it's kind of, it's kind of a strong cinnamon fragrance to me. So this isn't my favorite um, 
there's another candle that's quite similar to this, pumpkin carving, and I prefer pumpkin carving over the sweet cinnamon pumpkin. But I did pick that up for the collection. And then I also got the pumpkin peanut brittle. This is a nice candle to get. This is your crunchy caramel brittle, salty peanuts, and toasted pumpkin seeds. Mm, I love this one. It's kind of like a peanut fragrance. It's toasted. You got some of that pumpkin in there. Nice fall candle. Mm, sounds quite nice. <laughs> So on a little side note with this pumpkin peanut brittle, you guys, the lid this year is this pumpkin lid. And last year for the uh, fall preview candles, we had like, here's pumpkin apple from last year. And they also had the pumpkin lid. The pumpkin peanut brittle from last year, for whatever reason, the online exclusive candles would come with these or most of them came with these brushed copper lids so i think it was kind of funny that this year the online exclusive has last year's lid instead of uh the pumpkin silver pumpkin lid that the rest of them are getting so it's like this is online exclusive and i got the lid but for whatever reason this one's getting these uh pumpkin lids or I've been hearing a lot of people say that they've been getting this pumpkin lid on this candle. So I just thought it was funny that that's what's going on with that candle. Oh, thank you for sharing that. Thank you. Uh, okay, so I also picked up another uh, apple charcoal. This is a repurchase for me. I really like the apple charcoal, you guys. This is just your sweet red apple and smoked charcoal. And on cold, you just get that real sweet apple fragrance. Uh... I did a review on this and when you burn this candle, that apple, that sweet apple fragrance kind of mellows out a bit more. And then there is like just a touch of smokiness in it. Not like a wood smoke so much, but I guess kind of like a charcoal smoke, I guess you could call it. And then I also picked up uh, Fall Farmhouse, which is an online exclusive. And I really love this whole collection they did with these jars. Kind of looks like cracked glass. This is your spiced pumpkin, forest pine branch, and fresh fall air. Oh, I like it. <laughs> oh, when you smell this candle, it just smells like fall. Like fall has arrived when you smell this candle. The pumpkin and the pine in it, so good. I like it even more. <laughs> I don't know why this is an online exclusive. They should sell this in the stores. I think this would do great in stores. So picked up a fall farmhouse, first of the season. I'll definitely get some more of those this year. And then the last candle I picked up was flannel. I just love the colors they did for this jar. So pretty. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Your scent notes are fresh bergamot, heirloom mahogany, and soft musk. So I am not the biggest fan of flannel, you guys. It's been years since I've burned flannel or even purchased flannel. Just not a big fan of flannel. But after talking to a viewer on here about it, I decided I would give it a second chance this year. And I do like this jar style, love the colors. So I thought, okay, I'm gonna give it a second chance. But it's always been a little too strong for me and just a little too cologne smelling. Yeah, you get the bergamot but there's this cologne smell in there that I'm just not super crazy about, but I am gonna give this another try, see how it goes. So that is the haul, you guys. Please leave comments down below. Let me know if you got into the stores today or maybe online for the Clean Hands event and what you're hauling, or maybe you got into the store for that 40% off sale we had earlier in the week. And as always, please hit that subscribe button and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.